Hey guys, I'm Corinne from Move For You PT and I'm also one of the coaches here at Pro Raw Gym. Today I'm going to take you through a tutorial of how to use this contraption behind me, which is the combo rack, so stay tuned for that. While the combo rack is predominantly used by power lifters, it can be used by anyone in the gym. You just have to know how. So in case you didn't know, you can squat and bench in the combo rack. The bench height is the lower rack height and up the top we can place the barbell on the upper rollers for the squat. The main difference here is that when we're benching, we're gonna have this bench fixed in where I'm sitting, whereas when we're squatting, we're gonna take the bench out so that we have free movement for our feet and are able to squat comfortably. So as you can see, we are currently set up for the bench press. We have the bench in place and our bar is positioned on the lower rollers. But the next thing we have to do is actually set our safety so that we're nice and secure and safe just in case we happen to fail our lift. So what we're gonna do here is we're going to take these little metal pins out, elevate the safeties to the appropriate height, lock it in and we're good to go. If you have a higher bench arch, you may want to elevate the safeties a little bit higher. However, if you have a lower bench arch, you may want to lower them back down. Now we're ready to start squatting. So to begin, we're going to take the bench out of the bench position. We may need to unscrew these black little screws at the bottom if the bench is a little bit too tight. However, at the moment, it's nice and loose so we can just whip it out of its spot. Oh, no difficulty, awesome. From here, we're going to elevate the bar to the top rollers. But we're not done yet. We first need to adjust the height of the rack itself because frankly, we're all different heights. I'm a shorty, someone else might be really tall. So we need to fix that before we get started. To change the rack height, which you can do for both squat and bench, we need to make use of these lever arms. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this spare metal pin, lodge it into the inside of the rack so that it doesn't get caught on any of the weight plates. Set the lever on the pin and from here, we can manipulate our rack height with the second pin. So if you're a tall person, you might wanna opt for number nine. If you're a shorty like me, you're gonna be on set number five. Unlike a normal commercial rack, the combo racks have these awesome little rollers that allow you to slide the bar really comfortably to get into your perfect squat or bench position. They also have safeties that actually come out, which means you can leave them in for bench or you can take them out completely for squats. As a powerlifter, that's incredibly important because frankly, we don't have safeties in competition for squat. So being able to learn how to actually squat safely without them, with side spotters, is also incredibly important. So there you have it guys. So there you have it guys. There is your tour of the combo rack. If you have any additional questions, don't forget to leave them in the comments below. Stay tuned for the next video.